Florida State took an early 2-0 lead, but Tennessee came back and scored one run in each of the 5th, 6th, and 7th inning to take game one of the Knoxville Super Regional 3-2. And so having to prepare for three pitchers is always pretty tough. Um, they're pretty quick to, to pull pitchers, so you got to be able to make those adjustments throughout the lineup. And uh, I thought we attacked um, pitchers pretty well, other than uh, Gaffin when she got in there. She was dropping uh, the drop ball down pretty good, and uh, we chased a few, and tomorrow we might make sure that, that we get the ball up a little bit more and take advantage of that. But uh, I love the fight, I love the energy for seven innings, and uh, you know we had ourselves some chances, and that's all you can ask. We were doing exceptionally well um, until they brought in Rainey. Rainey has a really good drop ball, so we just have to go out there tomorrow, and if they pitch her, just see the ball up. They were starting to catch up a little bit, but I mean, I th still think I could have had them. I left a little bit over the plate. Um, just got to make sure I keep hitting the corners and hit my spots, and um, they're battling in there, but um, our defense can handle it, and uh, we'll just come back tomorrow and see what we can do. I think that's what's so great about you know having two days to, to come out and play. You get a game plan a little bit, and we're a smart team, and, and we do make some good adjustments, so I expect us to be off the get-go tomorrow, and you know, it's 14 innings now that we got to get after it. It's important to just like put this behind us, learn from it, learn what we did, make adjustments tomorrow, and come back and win too. Um, you know, we can't let that one linger behind in our heads. Just put, put like, like I said, just put it behind us, and uh, we'll go home, watch video, see what we can do, and our batters will make adjustments. I'll make adjustments, see what I can do. She said it all. Definitely just let it go and go out there tomorrow and just compete and fight. It's going to be a dog fight, and we're going to play two games, and we're going to come out with two wins. Florida State will now have to win two on. Friday, they'll get their first shot at 4 p.m. Eastern on ESPNU. If the Seminoles win that one, they'll go to a third and deciding game at 7 p.m. on ESPN2. That'll wrap up our coverage for now from Knoxville. LaneHurtSeminoles.com.